Hey y'all, so what is up? Welcome back to the channel. So today is going to be a fun one. I recently uh, made a purchase from Ulta and I picked up the new Too Faced Pumpkin Spice Palette and I picked up a couple other things. So I'm going to do like a mini haul and then we're going to do a swatching tutorial with the new Pumpkin Spice Too Faced Palette. little haul first I just got a few things I've been wanting to try out these new elf they are called the ride or die lip balm I got two shades the first one is called just peachy the other one is called tough cookie so I did try these out already and they are actually quite nice they I can't I don't really think they have a scent, which I'm kind of bummed about. I was hoping that they would have a scent. Because most of the time lip balms do. Okay, I feel like I can smell a light scent. Like, like maybe a light peachy scent. But it just adds like a really pretty shine to the lips. Nothing too crazy, but it's nice. It feels very hydrating. It's not sticky or anything. And then the other couple things I got is this Makeup Revolution Blush Burst Palette. And it's in collaboration with Roxy. And I don't even know who Roxy is. I don't know. I saw the palette and I just thought it looked really cute. I loved all of the pink, pinkness. Here's what the front looks like. And then the inside is just super pretty. It's all kinds of pinks. And I love these like marbled shades. We get two of them. This one, which isn't showing as much on camera. But this one is really pretty. It's marbled. So, got this. It was only like 8 or 10 bucks. Pretty cheap. Makeup Revolution is so cheap and so good. And then the last couple things I got is this Knobloch. By Amy Light's little quad. Oh, excuse me. It's like a. I think the palette is so intriguing. It's like clear, so you can see through it. And here's what the eyeshadows look like. There we go. Aren't those so pretty? And then the shade names are directly on the back, which is kind of interesting. So, I just love this. I think it looks so, like, expensive. Like, I cannot wait to try that out. Maybe I will use this with the Pumpkin Spice Palette today. And the very last thing I got is this Buxom Full On Plumbing Lip Cream. And it is the, like, fall scent. It's called Pumpkin Spice Latte. And this does smell quite nice. And I have a couple of the other Buxom Full and Plumping Lip Glosses, but I don't like the, like, normal line of these because they just smell like full-on peppermint and I just can't take it. So I do have a few of the, like, seasonal collection. I think it was the coffee, coffee line they had where it kind of smelled like coffee. I think that's the other couple that I have. And then this one smells like pumpkin spice. Really good. like that a lot. So that is my quick little mini, mini haul from Ulta of the things I got. And of course the Too Faced Pumpkin Spice Palette. I will, let's just go ahead and open this up. So the packaging is a lot like the, um, like the original Gingerbread Palette. They're both like metal and um, I don't have the Extra Spice Gingerbread Palette, I just have the first one. So here's what the inside looks like. I think it's really pretty. You have a nice array of like warm tones, some pops of pink and purple. This yellow shade is super pretty. And then some really pretty shimmers. And it does come with a cute mirror. Again, here's what the front looks like. 
So, real quick, I'm sorry if this lighting is off a little bit right now. When I zoom in with an item, it just doesn't want to refocus with the lighting. I don't know. I don't know. So, I'm going to go ahead and do some swatches of this real quick. I'm just going to do like a hands worth. I, I'm not a fan of like swatching every single color. I feel like that's a bit much. But this one is called... This one is called Pumpkin Spice and Chill. It's a really pretty pink. Um, oh no, sorry. That one is called You Spicy. This purple shade is called Pumpkin Spice and Chill. It's a nice like duochrome purple. And then the mustard yellow one. This one is called Pumpkin Spice. Oh, that's so pretty. This really pretty gold shade. This one is called Fall Vibes. And then the very last one we'll do, we'll do this deep purple. It's called Spice of Life. Alright, so here's what the shades look like. I think they are super pretty. I think the mattes and the shimmers are just stunning in this palette. So excited, especially this yellow. Oh my goodness. Okay, I have a fall candle burning in the background and I did decorate for fall. So excited for fall. I'm wearing a sunflower shirt today with a cute little fall cardigan. I'm just, uh, I'm feeling the fall vibes, guys. I don't know if you guys are, but I probably decorate, I put up my fall stuff. It was last weekend, so it was like the third weekend of August. And I was like, it's time. It's time. <laughs> so I felt like my first video with my fall decor, the pumpkin spice theme, it was just perfect, you know? I know I want to go in with the shade called pumpkin spice. It's just that really pretty yellow shade right here in the middle. I'm just going to take that on a fluffy blending brush. Oh, you can see my candle in the background. I'm just going to take that on a fluffy blending brush. I'm going to kind of take it in my crease and go a little bit higher above my crease. That's just kind of how I do my eye looks. I feel like I should do like a fall evening routine video. Let me guys, let me guys, let me know in the comments down below if you guys would like to see like a fall evening routine. I might do that when it gets a little bit closer, like, into fall, but... Okay, this yellow blended out perfectly. It's so nice. I'm gonna move on into... Let's see. I think the shade right next door to it, I'm gonna take it on more of a... Like, defined blending brush which is called Ginger Spice, which is next to the yellow is this like orangey color. I'm going to put that right below the, the yellow, kind of to do like a monochromatic look. Okay. So I just blended in the orange and kind of pulled it on up with the yellow. I'm going to take just a little bit more of the yellow on this fluffy blending brush to kind of like work on blending the two colors together really good. Okay, that's so pretty. Alright, then I'm going to take the shade called Love You, no, sorry, it's called Spice Spice Baby, it's the one below the yellow, this one, I'm going to take it on that brush I used with the orange shade, I'm going to put it in my uh, lower lash line. Okay. Then I'm going to go into the, let's see, I'm going to go into the Wanna Piece of Me shade. It's kind of this like shimmer green. Yes. And I'm just going to put that all over my lid. 
Ooh, the fallout with this shade is uh, not playing games. That is rough. I feel like this palette is like the perfect palette if you are just like into a lot of warm tones. It does have a lot of warm tones but it does have some cool tones with these purples in here. Alright and then I'm going to take this like flat, it's this like flat liner brush. I'm going to take this with some of the I guess I'll go with the spice of uh, no warm and cozy. This shade. This is the darkest shade in the palette. And then I'm just gonna like tight line my lower lash line just to add a little bit more dimension. Okay, and then I'm gonna take the gold shade called Fall Vibes. This one right here, I'm going to take it on my pinky and I'm going to pop that right in the inner corner. So pretty. Alright, I'm going to put on a little bit of mascara and we'll be right back. Okay guys, so I put on some mascara. I'm going to go ahead and apply some of this new MAC liquid lipstick that I got in my BoxyCharm. It's in the shade Mocha. I just felt like this would be like perfect with this eye look. Okay you guys, so that is going to be the conclusion for today's video. Um, my thoughts on the Pumpkin Spice palette, I highly recommend it. I know it is a $49 palette, so it is quite expensive, but I went ahead and used some of my Ulta points to get it, so it wasn't near the $49 mark. So that's, uh, you know, it's an option for you. I did purchase this from Ulta. Because I like their point system. That way if you do want to get a higher priced item. You know you can use some of those points. Get it for a cheaper uh, price point. <laughs> and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed my little mini haul. Too Faced palette try on video. Don't forget before you leave to hit the thumbs up button. And subscribe down below. And hope you all have a great day. And don't forget that you are actually setting Bye y'all, thanks for watching. So check out my Instagram pages at Colorful Gidget or my new brand at Spunky Scrunchies. And don't forget, if you haven't subscribed, click the circular icon in the middle. Or if you haven't seen my most recent or another favorite of mine, click the one on the top right or the bottom right.